With far fewer cars on the road, traffic has been a breeze, but some drivers are confusing the open road with a racetrack. Tori Mason talked to a state trooper who says speeding puts more than just drivers at risk. The highways are unusually empty right now, but that doesn't mean they're your personal speedway. Many drivers have been taking advantage of the open roads, but law enforcement wants them to know they're still here. We want people to do the right thing, and for the most part, people are. But according to CSP, many lead feet aren't staying home. In Thornton, a driver was clocked going 128 miles per hour in a 55. Did this person really need to be out and letting them know? In Lakewood, a 16-year-old with no license was caught going 104 miles per hour. We have actually issued more speeding tickets for 20 or over and get this 40 or more than we have uh, last month or in January. CSP troopers are essential workers and they're honored to be out helping drivers. But now there are more dangers than passing cars that don't pull over. Anytime we have to make that traffic stop that we don't know who we're coming in contact with. CSP hopes people understand that driving recklessly is not only dangerous for those on the road, but for everyone who will risk their lives to save you. If they get into a crash, not only are we now exposed to that crash and, and them, but we have EMTs, nurses, doctors, other people who have to come out and help control that scene or could have been utilizing those resources to actually fight this virus. I'm Tori Mason, covering Colorado First.